I am a lover of avocado. Okay. I love it, love it, Me love too. it. I don't think I've ever, I ever had it when I was a child growing up. Mm. I mean, it wasn't something that we had in the house. Okay. Um, and I think that I just became a lover of it, of it maybe just a, a few years ago. Welcome back to our channel, Meatless Mondays. How you doing? I'm good. <laughs> Before you get started, please remember to like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss anything. Yep. Yep. So what we got today? What are we doing today? So I am a lover of avocado. Okay. I love it, love it, Me love too. it. I don't think I've ever I ever had it when I was a child growing up. Mm. I mean it wasn't something that we had in the house okay um and i think that i just became a lover of it of it maybe just a, a few years ago mm -hmm. um i don't know if it was because i thought that there was no flavor it, I, I don't know what it was but i love it same here i mean i can peel one and eat it i, I love it too so anyway we're going to make our version of avocado toast. Yummy. As you can see, I'm using two different breads. One is a corn tortilla wrap, and the other one is a waffle that's also gluten-free. I'm gluten-free and vegan. And this is the same corn tortilla that we used when we made the chickpea mash that day, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, yeah. So what I did was I put both of the pieces of bread in the oven so that it could get toasty. Mm -hmm crunchy for like a toast right you can use a crack you can use crackers for this you can use um, chips of some sort like a you know a big a, a bigger chip okay um, a, tortilla if, if you, a tortilla chip a larger one mm -hmm. if you'd like you can warm those up which is really good warmed yes. up in the oven um, and so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to place some, well, I've mashed, I've mashed the avocado with a fork. I don't like mine um, mashed in a, food, in a food processor or a blender because I find, yeah. Like the, yeah, that chunky. Yeah, I want to keep some bite to it. Same here. And so I just slather it. Mm, you can I use know, that word. That sounds like, I know. And I put some on the, corn tortilla. Inside this mash, I have cilantro, some lemon juice, some shallots, um, a little bit of salt, mm -hmm. and some other, you can use other seasonings. If you like your spicy, you can use some um, pepper flakes. Um, you know, if you don't, don't. You can put corn in it. You can you can use whatever you want in it, but the main ingredient is avocado. I'm going to top one with thank you the salad, a mixture of and what's in there? This wonderful salad that I made. So it has cucumber, tomato, some seasonings, of course, and then what I did was I use some vegan mayo mm -hmm. oh and it has of course um, some power greens and the great part about it is that the vegan mayo mixed with the tomatoes makes sort of a what dress a thousand island a thousand one of my favorites yes a thousand island I'm not like water right now I'm sorry I'm like, <laughs> Because, I'm telling you because it's like it comes it's like almost sweet mm -hmm. right you can almost drink the juice mm -hmm. and then the other one I'm going to tar so you taught me well I, I took yes. all the recipe yes and I'm trying to it's not perfected yet but I'm getting it looks I'm good. getting it to smells, your level it smells so good so I made my chickpea 
tuna salad. And I think I'm just gonna put some in the center. Yes. And then I'm going to take a one of the vegan cheese, a piece of the vegan cheese, mm. and I'm gonna just crisscross it. Ooh, that looks yummy. Mm. Yum! Oh, maybe I'll take one of the tomatoes, a piece of the tomato, and I'll just sit it on top. That looks so cute, right? So now my turn. Your turn, so we'll switch plates. Okay. So I'm also doing the avocado toast, but instead of using um, gluten-free bread, this is just vegan toast that I'm using. It's like a flatbread, and it's a little bit crunchy. So I'm going to start with the avocado. Mm. I'm spread it on. Yummy, it smells delicious. Mm. Then I'm going to top one of mine. I love, I like to have two options. I'm always like a sweet and a savory. So my sweet option is my sweet potato, which I'm going to add. Mm. And then I'm gonna add my piece of cheese. I'll just add one slice. I'll add, I'll add two slices. I'll be a little bit today. And then I'm going to use the chickpea mash for the other one. Nice. And on my savory one, I like spice. So I have a little bit of sriracha that I'm going to add. It's a little. Ooh. I think I can't wait until we stop recording. <laughs> I want to taste. Is that okay? Do you mind? No, I want to hear the crunch. Okay, I'm going to dig in because I'm It's just, toast. It's toast. It's like looking delicious. Oh, my mouth is watering. Wow, did you hear mm. that? Mmm, I have to see that. Mm. That's okay. Good, good, good. <laughs> so while she's chewing, um, it's delicious. Avocado is so good for you. It's one of the healthy fats. So, if you want a healthy, well, you should have a healthy fat mm -hmm. in what it is that you um, eat during the day. Yes, definitely. And avocado is one of them. Mm -hmm. And again, it's one of those things that it'll keep you, like, I can eat avocado toast for breakfast, and I probably will last till about 12, 1 o'clock until I have to eat again. Because mm -hmm. that healthy fat really just keeps you fuller longer. And I'm all about those type of foods, right. those healthy fats that keep you mm -hmm. full and longer. And that, because I'm a big snacker, and so a meal like this will help me not snack until the time of the next meal. So I'm excited to add this to my breakfast Good. Like lunch option. Good. Good. So thank you all for joining us. Yeah. I hope you learned something. I hope you try it. It is delicious. Please visit us on Instagram at the Meatless Mondays. Send us a message if you've tried it. If you have any questions for us, if you're transitioning, we are here to help you. Um, and if you have any, you know, comments, feel free to comment below. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you continue to tune in. Please remember to like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so that you don't miss any of this deliciousness. We have some delicious things on the way. Please remember to also visit my other YouTube channel, Asanto and Zinga, and do the same over there. And remember, peace, love, and vegan eating! <laughs>